this Loki season two trailer. It says it's breaking the Disney Plus records. That's what they saying, man. Since the first trailer, the Loki season two uh, dropped is already breaking records. The trailer has been reviewed or viewed, I'm sorry, over 80 million times in just a few days, making this Disney's, uh, Disney Plus's biggest debut yet for a trailer. Um, and we can, you know what, let's, let's hop into this trailer real quick. We'll do that. Hop into the trailer real quick. Let's see what's good. Obi? Hello? We have a little bit of a situation. Oh, it look crazy, you know what I'm saying? Mobius. Wow. Great to see Got you the again. homie. The homie showing up. Got some things Glad going on with uh Loki wow. glitching or time something. Slipping. They're calling that time you slipping. You know that? Yeah. You've seen that? Yeah. Can you fix that? So, no. um It's impossible to time slip in the TVA. I know. So already we this trailer is already starting off with with some mysteries and things of that nature. Keep it moving. We just saw it happen. Um, yeah. Mobius is back. I've been pulled, and I got a question about this whole time slipping between thing too, the man. past and the present. We'll Hello? we'll get into that. It's just weird stuff true, going on. There's nothing to stand between this world and utter destruction. As you see, Only Jonathan Major is prominent, good prominent in this work. in the trailer, which is Listen, which is good. Styles. You're a man of action, which is fine. <laughs> So it seems like I they are going to actually be doing literal time, you know what I'm saying? Time travel. It's really goodbye. Not like the last time they were just going to different. We might actually be getting them set in certain to periods us. of time. Stuff like that. This which might play place. a little bit better than, than the first season. Okay. <laughs> Whatever we do. TVA. The, the thing about TVA is it seems like a lot of their stuff is based off of old technology, even gods. though it works like new technology. And I hope we get like real Loki. How do you choose? You know what I'm saying? Like the god of myth, Loki. You know what I'm saying? And, and who dies? The way you know, they the even got Ren Slayers in it. Victor it's Timely. But when I say that, Walk meaning like way. the god Loki with his powers and things, you know what I'm saying? We didn't really get none of that in the first season. You know what I'm so under power. Always have been. Okay, look like we might Always be getting some be. good stuff. We'll, over the we'll see. You think? I thought it was spot on. I mean, because. I just want, you know, I want Marvel to win. They're just not winning right now, man. What? And I think that was, what was that? October 6th? Okay, October 6th. Streaming October 6th, ladies and gentlemen. Um, but yeah, no, I want, I want Marvel to win. And they have not been winning lately. I don't know what the hell's been going on with, with my guys over there at Marvel, Kevin Feige and the crew. Don't know what's really been going on, man, but you know. We'll see, man. But like to get back to this trailer, you know what I'm saying? Uh, we get we get Loki back in action. This time he's gonna be facing off against uh seem like a new threat with him glitching and everything like that. We get uh some familiar faces, Sylvie Mobius, Ravana Renslayer. I hope we get more on Ravana Renslayer and her connection to Kang. Uh, because that's Ravana Renslayer is a big motivation for Kang or Victor Timely, which is who we saw. Basically, Jonathan Major's character in this. Uh, he's a big motivation. I mean, I'm sorry. She's a big motivation for Kang and, and, and the uh, machinations that he goes through and the reason why. We, you know, we know that that first season was a critical success, man. Critical commercial success. It was it was pretty much. uh a Disney Plus staple for Marvel is, is kind of what got these Marvel series off the ground, that and one division. So, you know, uh, seems like we're going to be getting a new threat in, in Kang or Victor Timely or or maybe a whole bunch of new threats. Maybe Kang isn't the only new threat. Uh, we see the glitching or the time slipping, right? Sylvie, we don't know what part Sylvie plays. Is she good? Is she bad? I you know what I'm saying? I, I really didn't like her. I don't like her. You know what I'm saying? But we don't know too much about the plot. Um, 
the only thing we know is multiverse is not going anywhere and i kind of hate that i wish they would really get rid of that shit figure out a way to maneuver themselves away from the multiverse um but you know it is what it is man loki season two should should be a wild ride hopefully uh lots of twists and turns probably just looking at that trailer look like it's gonna be a whole bunch of twists and turns man um and i wanted to be unpredictable what we got from secret invasion was a lot of that was just predictable you know what i'm saying everything about that was just kind of like you knew what the what the next turn was gonna be you know what i'm saying but is what it is so but if you're a fan man i'm a, I'm still a fan i'm still holding on hope for marvel man so i'm gonna tune in and, and since i review this shit i'm gonna tune in and give y'all my honest review on it and if it if if i deem it not to be good i'm gonna let y'all know that it ain't good and i'm gonna give y'all the reasons why i think it's not good but be on the lookout for that october 6th loki season two is on the way man um yeah on the way